My name is Dr. Hamid Karbasi and I'm an industrial researcher at Constell College. My research is focused on advanced recycling technologies for waste electrical and electronic equipment. The growing concern of treating electronic waste responsibly is a reality and it requires innovative solutions. Here at Constell College Center for Smart Manufacturing, we work closely with our industry partners on a host of very exciting research projects. These projects are meant to significantly improve the industry's efficiency and productivity in electronic waste recycling. In this video, we are thrilled to present one of our recent robotic recycling projects funded by Ontario Centers of Excellence, OCE, and Green Tech International. Test 591. We have practicality here. A lot of other schools don't have the trades around. They don't have people that are knowledgeable in metalworking, machining, things like that. And there's only so much you can get from theory in a textbook. You need to physically do something in order to understand it. We're at Conestoga College in the Advanced Sensors Lab, which is an offshoot of the Center of Smart Manufacturing. I work here as a research assistant. Uh, essentially, they give us a problem and with oversight from a professor who's knowledgeable in the area. We work directly with industry and we come up with a solution. I've been working on the uh, advanced uh, robotic recycling uh, project where we uh, recycle uh, flat panel displays and, uh, and CRTs as well using uh, vision guided robotics. Um, I take part in the project with uh, two other students. I do a lot of the mechanical work, the design and manufacturing and assembly as well as I do some vision work, uh, robot programming, electrical work, and I take on most of the clerical work, dealing with suppliers, getting the best prices for quotes, and making sure everything's kept in order. And also the uh, building and implementation of all the parts. To me, it's more about becoming better. You, every single time you solve a problem, you understand a new part of the way that the world works around you and a new way to interface things. A technical challenge helps you grow. You can only become so great in a comfort zone. By doing something outside of that, you're able to grow as a person, you're able to become smarter and better. I wanted to come here because I'm a hands-on learner and I like to learn the application of what I'm learning in school. So all the classwork, I was I'd learn the formulas and the theory, and then I'd have classes where I'd be able to apply that and actually use my hands-on skills to reiterate my knowledge and understand. The reason that I'm in the field that I'm in is because I just wanted to do something interesting and different every day. This school specifically, it was Polytechnic Edge. Polytechnic, um, to me, is the fusion of practicality and theory together and applied into real-life applications. I learned a lot about the weight, electrical waste industry, um, just kind of what has to do there and how to, make, how to make profit in it, which is quite interesting. Automation is important to the uh, recycling industry because it requires high levels of efficiency in order to meet profit margins. Also, I've learned a lot about robot programming and how to interact between um, different uh, programming systems, different uh, robots and different um, electrical units. Um, along with my mechanical work and my SOLIDWORKS experience, it's gradually like increased and gotten better. I've been able to really hone those skills so when I get out into the workplace I'm able to be a significant asset. The research helped me figure out more or less what I wanted to do. I chose to do research at Conestoga College because it allows me to express my engineering theory and my skills into a practical industrial setting. Research here at Conestoga has been amazing. It's uh, really helped me go forward and it's the school we have projects but they only, it's, they're in large groups, so you only get to do certain amounts of the project. But here, since there's been two, three of us, we've really had to all be involved in everything very heavily, and it's helped us gain knowledge everywhere moving forward. I'm Tony Parada, and I'm the founder and president of Green Tech. We are a company that specializes in secure disposal. It's important that this material, when it comes to end of life, is properly sanitized and uh, that all the information is wiped. Uh, and also, if, if it cannot be reused, then when it's destroyed, securely destroyed, uh, and recycled in a, in a compliant, environmentally compliant way. So when we started five years ago, you know, we were just getting ourselves uh, started in these research projects. 
uh, we could see how, how great it's been, you know, in the, pr in the progress over the last five years. It's really helped us tremendously because Conestoga College is able to take on projects that we are not able to take on internally, especially on the research of uh, technologies that you know you're going to be using in the next five, ten years from now, you know. Um, and and I've all, I'm a big believer in, in investing in your business and also investing in the future. And for us, this relationship is basically an investment in our future. The students at Conestoga College are the future. They're going to be they're being exposed now to the realities of what's happening out there in the marketplace, and uh, they're also being involved. They're getting involved in uh, you know some of the problem solving that, that we need. I just want to thank uh, Conestoga College for uh, for for working with us uh, over the last past five years. It, for us, it's been a very successful relationship, um, and we're starting to see now the fruits of our labor that we've invested in five years ago. We have a, you know, a new color optical sorting system that we've implemented on our lines that we're currently using on a, on a real production environment. This was a beta test you know, we started with three, four years ago. It's now actually live in a production environment. And I look forward to having uh, other solutions like that, you know, especially the, uh, the medium infrared, infrared technology we're working on to sort black plastics and uh, the robotics uh, that we're investing in right now in research to uh, harvest you know, um, hazards out of, uh, out of electronics and process, you know, hard, hard to process electronics. Well, you know, anytime you're, you're working with uh, students and uh, colleges, especially a polytechnic college, you know, they have, the, they have a lot of technical expertise. The staff, I mean, the, the, the professors or PhDs in, in technology, you know, we've worked with Amit uh, Karbazi. He's been he's been amazing. You know, he knows his stuff. He's very technical. Uh, the people we're working with are, are, are academics. They they research. You know, they they they're thorough in their research. And and for us, that makes us feel good. That hey, you know, we don't have to worry about you know not have, having not having the right type of uh, uh, technical skills. You know, they have it. We're using it, and it's great.